Okay guys, sorry about that. My uh, my phone got too low to keep running the camera, so uh, this is will be this will be the part two of, of the video that I was just making. So I'll put this one up immediately following the the other one when I upload it here soon. But um, to pick up where I left off and getting started every day and, and striving for excellence and trying to be the best that you can be every day. One thing that has always stuck with me and that I always try to tell myself is the journey of a thousand miles starts with but one footstep, right? So you've got to take that first step and then just keep putting one foot in front of the other and just keep moving forward. And of course, there's gonna be obstacles in your way. There's gonna be roadblocks. There's gonna be traffic to hold you up, things to kind of keep you from progressing. But use each one of those hurdles as a stepping stone to greatness. You know, don't see it as an obstacle or it will be I think that in every situation no matter how fucked up it might seem there's always a positive aspect to it that ultimately was for the greater good and that will propel you forward in very very short order if you only embrace it and see it for what it is and not let it overpower you and, and bring you down. I think that through our preconditioning as humans over thousands and thousands of years that's what we have been led to believe that that we're weak that we need other people and that we need these leaders to lead us and tell us what and how to live and that we can't stand on our own two feet and that we can't do great things that only they can do great things because they are in total communion with these gods or gods or deities or what have you. Remember that you are gods and goddesses, each one of you. You're living fucking proof of fucking greatness. And I don't care how you feel right now, if you do feel like a piece of shit, get the fuck up and realize how great you are. Feel your power and your energy coursing through your veins and your body. And accept it and take hold of it. Claim it. Claim it as yours. You've got to do that. You've got to claim that shit as yours and claim who you are in this world. That you're not just going to be another weak sheep, but that you're going to be great and that you're going to rise up and then you're going to show these people how it's done, right? Leading by example in all things. And I'm not saying that you have to be perfect, because you don't. I know that I'm not. I am so far fucking from it that it is ridiculous. But I still strive to be. And I still know that I'm great. I know that I'm powerful. I know that I'm a fucking fabulous man. I know this, deep down in my heart. And I'm not going to let anybody tell me otherwise at all. If they try to, fuck them. And they only say in that because they themselves have not claimed their own individual power yet. And that's sad that they, they need to. The only way that they can make themselves feel good and feel powerful is to try to take away my power. And I'm not going to let that happen. And I'm not going to try to take anybody else's power away from them either. Unless, of course, they come after me trying to take mine. Don't ever allow that.
Don't ever be allowed to be walked on. Fuck that. So I hope that talking about this left-hand path paradigm today and how these other aspects of these other religions, Christianity, Judaism, and Islam, have affected each and every one of us in our own personal way in very, very deep ingrained ways that even our own conscious minds can't really comprehend because it's such a deep, deep subconscious ingraining that you really don't even realize it's happening. Think for yourself. You guys know what is right deep down inside of you. And you don't even need to tell, like, need me to tell you that by any means. And I'm not trying to tell you. I'm really just trying to give you a little nudge and a little reminder to wake up. To open your eyes and realize your greatness. Realize how wonderful and spectacular that you really and truly are. That you are a fucking marvelous creation. And that you can do fucking great things each and every day. Always. And don't let anyone, anyone, tell you any different. Thanks guys, I appreciate you watching again. And as soon as these other things don't keep flooding my mind, I'll get that chakra video made. <laughs> so um, maybe that'll happen this weekend. But um, anyhow, I hope everybody's taking care out there, everybody's doing well. It's a holiday weekend, so Spend some time with your family and enjoy them. Spread some love. Show some love. That's what I'm going to do. But I'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Take care.